Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about simple and compound interest. Find the total value of the investment after the time given. If I was given this problem, $28,600 at 7.9% compounded semi-annually for two years. Mm -hmm. From that, we have to find our variables that we need here. Our principal, first thing that's written here, is $28,600. They tell us an interest rate of 7.9%. As a decimal, we convert that to be 0 0.079. Now, compounded semi-annually, our end value here, that is number of times we compound in a year. Semi-annually means two times, right? twice in a year, and our time in years total is two years as well, All right? or two as well. Right? So with that, we plug that into our formula provided for compound interest. A equals my principal, 28,600. Multiply that by one plus R, my interest rate, 7.9. Oh, not 7.9. Interest rate as a decimal, that's a common mistake. I see students make all the time. Be careful, <laughs> right, as a decimal. 0.079, okay, over the number of times we uh, compound in a year, which is two times, being semi-annually, to the exponent of two times the number of years, which is two. This gives us our final investment value of $33,393.66. Quick recap, we're given $28,600 at 7.9%, compounded semi-annually for two years. And we have to find the total value of that investment. Well, we found